Oilers hosting the Senators, and the Senators are plus 160 on the money line. The Oilers are minus 194. The over-under is at 6.5 goals. The Senators getting a goal and a half on the puck line are minus 137, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you'd win. They lose by one goal, you win. And the Oilers laying a goal and a half on the puck line are plus 114, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win this game by two goals or more. It's supposed to be Corpusalo and Skinner. Neither goaltender has been confirmed, and those are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to puck drop tomorrow. Now, this is their first meeting between each other yet this season. Head-to-head, -head, the Oilers are on a two-game winning streak. The Oilers are 8-2 and two against the Senators in the last 10. The home team is 5-5. Five and five. The favorite has won the last two games they've played against each other. The favorite is 8-2 and two on the money line, and the favorite winning these games by multiple goals, laying a goal and a half on the puck line, is 6-4. and four. There have been three one-goal games in their last 10. The overs hit in their last two. The over-under is 5-5, five and five, and the over-under at 6.5 goals is 5-5. Five and five. The Senators are 1-3 in their last four. There was a total of eight goals, six goals, nine goals, and five goals. They scored two goals in a loss, five goals in a win, three goals in a loss, and then one goal in a loss. The last two games they played, they were on the road. For the Oilers, they are on a one, two, three, four, five, six-game winning streak. There was five goals, five goals, seven goals, uh, nine goals, forgive me, and then seven goals. They scored five goals in a win, three goals in a shootout win, seven goals in a win. That was the game that I said seven, and then five goals in a win. They've been winning, they've been scoring, and they've been beating they've been beating some some very good teams. They had a couple of meh teams thrown in there as well. I'm gonna take the Oilers with the money line. I will take the Oilers laying the goals and I'm gonna go over these are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.